Hi everyone, so I don't actually remember the last time I sat down and filmed a video, but when I first started my channel I had this, well I wanted to make it into a series which was Let's Catch Up. So I remember I think my first video I was talking about moving, getting into university or getting accepted into university or something like that, and so much has changed since then, and in the last month or two or however long since I've sat down and actually talked to you about my life rather than showing you holiday videos or I don't know, haul videos or whatever. Um, a lot has happened, so I am going to share with you some of that. <sighs> wow, that looked really weird in my viewfinder. <laughs> One of the first things you might have noticed if you follow me on Instagram or Twitter is that I have actually moved into a house. I no longer live in student accommodation, which I, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of happy about. I mean, I was 10 floors up, um, with a beautiful view, got the sunset every night, which is amazing, and obviously having an ensuite is, you know, good. But I now have a double bed, I have room to have my piano on a stand, I've got a big desk, and I, I love my room to bits. I have been living in this house for, I think, just over a month now, so I'm getting, still getting into the swing of things and redecorating and stuff. I, I still need to get like a little bedside table. Um, I have kind of gone with like a greeny yellow design because if you know me you know yellow is my favourite colour but um, I don't know if you're going to be able to see my fireplace has green in it and my room is very green at the minute should I explain my backdrop? I feel like I want to do that that is a cactus <laughs> that I actually got from Fujifilm they sent it to me mm, yes. this is from Tiger and was in my Christmas stocking last year this is the candle from Primark. This was made for me from my friend Sam, who has a YouTube channel. And his mum made it in her shop and it was my Christmas present. And this is a stone that my mum gave me because we collect stones of holes in them and she wanted me to put it on my mantelpiece. Yeah, I know, I'm really cute. I did a room tour last year and it was quite popular. I think people kind of like to see how I decorated a small uni room kind of thing. So even though this room's not small, I feel like I've got quite a few ideas for like storage and stuff. So I'm gonna get that done for you in the next few weeks and I really hope you enjoy that. Um, but yeah, that's my first point. I have moved into a new house. And if you wanna know, I am living with four of my best friends from uni. I won't name them or anything like that because I don't know if they want to be, you know, blasted all over the internet. But yeah, I really like being here and I have actually, over the summer, I really miss London. But I do have to say, in a few days, I'm going home for the weekend um, with my boyfriend, which will be so much fun. I love being in Norfolk, obviously, but I feel like if I'm there for a long period of time, sometimes I can get a bit bored. Um, I think how fast-paced it is in London and how I'm always doing you know, uni work or there's uni events or just in general things to do in London because, let's be real, London is the busiest city in England. <laughs> okay, so the second thing which you might think this is total clickbait, Hannah, why have you put this in your title? I have done something of a daring. I joined a pole dancing society. Um, well, not pole dancing, pole fitness, sorry. Um, yeah, it was like £60 for the whole year and I get to learn how to pole dance. I don't know if any of you will know this, but I was actually a dancer from the age of 3 till 18, so I really do miss dancing. Um, but at my university there's quite a lot of musical theatre students and drama students and I didn't really want to be overwhelmed by that because obviously I'm not a professional dancer anymore. Like, I used to dance quite a lot, but, you know, I'm not going to try and get onto Broadway or anything like that. So when I saw the pole fitness I thought that's going to be a fun way of exercising and yeah it's kind of jokes because it's like yes I'm a pole dancer but whenever I've been telling people that they've kind of been going uh what Hannah you're you're a pole dancer what what were you talking about? You may have noticed that in the last few months ish I've been really bad at uploading um and I don't mean that I haven't been uploading because I have just very infrequently which is really bad for me and also the content is changing. Um, I didn't really know how to I didn't really know how to address this without like making an individual video about it and I didn't really want to do that because then it seems like a really big deal like oh my gosh what are you blah, 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 blah. basically I want to start changing my content a little bit. 
Obviously, I do love fashion and I do love beauty and that is a part of who I am. But also, you know, I'm a university student and I'm a musician. I play the piano, I play the guitar, I sing. Um, I think the thing is, is I just feel a little bit Disneyified. I feel like the content I was creating, the fact there was no swearing and, you know, they kind of, it kind of zoellified me a bit and I didn't necessarily like that. Obviously she's amazing and everything and I adore Zoella, but I wanted to make sure that I was still being myself and I didn't feel like I really was and that's why I didn't want to sit down and I didn't want to talk to a camera because I didn't want to come across as this person that I wasn't. I'm not sure that made any sense, but I don't script my videos, um, I just say it how it is. And my content is going to change a little bit in the next few months, but not in a bad way. I'm still going to do beauty, you know, I've got another budget beauty lined up, which I'm so excited to share with you all. I just feel like I need to university my videos, make them more me and more musical as well because let's be real it is a huge part of my life and it's very silly of me to not include it. So that is all I have to say I think. Let me have a look at my little notepad of uh, points. The only thing I've got on here which I haven't told you is that I'm in my second year of uni which I'm sure you kind of got from this video. Anyway I don't really want to tell you what uni I'm at. I guess I could tell you what I'm studying but Meh. I think when I graduate I'll do like a video like, oh graduating university and then I'll have like the name and everything in it because, you know, you've got to kind of be a little bit safe online and stuff like that. Wow, my nose looks really weird from this angle. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that, but that is my setup at the minute. I am literally the worst YouTuber ever. I left my tripod in my garage back home in Norfolk. I am an idiot. I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope you enjoy my uh, new background and I will see you soon with a new video, bye!